Hey, what's going on, guys? Ultimate Flyer here, back with another video. And in today's video, video, we're going to be driving the Russian reserve tanks. These are the T26 and the BT5. They're both really well classed for low tier. Uh, they've got great guns, but not so good armament. Um, so let's hope not die and live through the entire battle. Um, I've got quite high piercing armor rounds with um, H here at the end, so it will conflict a lot of damage. This is my favorite out of the two reserve tanks, the BT-5. It's a lot more maneuverable and has got a higher caliber gun, I think. I think it's just all round better. Um, I don't think it's armor is as good, but that's a trade-off. Also, where the ammo is held on this thing, it protects the crew, but as soon as one gets damaged, the tank blows up. So, there's not really much point for that. I guess it helps it a bit. But, I've moved up and I want to just poke my head over this wall. And then just roll out whenever there's a tank. I get into a perfect spot, actually. Where I literally just camp out A, right here. But I soon realise that I'm not far enough up. Um, tell me what you guys want to see next in the comment section. Um, I think a jet gameplay, yeah, it just got come out and hope you guys enjoyed that. Tell me what videos you like more, tank or air. Um, I should be doing a Halifax formation one, uh, which is a British bomber. But, yeah, so I roll out a bit too far and there's a tank see him hit a critical on his I don't see him anymore I didn't get his drive unfortunately and I look left just roll out a bit I thought that was the guy then I get a kill on the guy which was a really lucky shot see that guy roll out boom Panzer 2 is dead. I roll out a bit and then from all of a sudden there's a tank behind me, kills me. Which is a bit on. I'm surprised how it got there that fast. I'm really surprised about that. But we've got two kills on and we've still got one more tank to go, which isn't great because, um,. The battle's probably a fifth of the way through, maybe even a tenth. So it's not great. So I've got I know that I have to live in this tank for a while now. So I can't be as aggressive, but I can still snipe people, it's a high caliber gun. Uh I think I've upgraded this tank fully and Yeah. So right now I'm going to A, which I will start to snipe people. Uh, I'm second in my team. Um, and hopefully I can get a couple early kills. Uh, me and like another wave of tanks, which is quite surprising. I think they all got killed by the same tank as me because no one was really expecting it. I think I saw movement there and... Well, I'm not sure I did. I think I might have. Um, I'm... Just right now, moving up with my team a bit, helping out. Uh, I see shells, so I stop. I angle my armour so that they would bounce. I look for the shells, so I, and I can move up a bit more because that BT-5 is hammering. But, yeah. I've got 205 rounds, and this is basically the same round which I was using for my BT-5. I think it might even be the same gun. Uh, well, the enemy team has is captured and is now we're capping it again, or not? So we I know there's a guy A and I angle my armor, but there's a guy critical hit him, uh, but he's not dead now he is, but my end is out, so I'm just preparing for this twenty seconds. I see a wheel out of a guy hit him and then he rolls back. I thought I could get under his tank. 
the shell explodes and then explodes up into his tank and it would kill him but that I unfortunately hit his wheel uh, it's almost repaired okay I roll up a bit still angling my armor there's a guy get okay. no I don't I start to lag quite a bit actually but um yeah I get a double kill which is really nice um but yeah I start to experience a bit of lag when I move up I think and it puts me off quite a bit but now that we have a free objective to cap A I get another guy what a like shot that is I just saw like the explosions of it but that's probably best or one of the best ever tank shots I've ever done enemy heat Heinkel 51 is up which is a biplane so it's not too worrying but be better if it wasn't because now that just means that they have air superiority I'm checking guy left guy right none there I roll out a bit more because I can just see see more explo uh, gun explosions um but yeah, this is where I start to roll up into A and just see bullets. Well, no, tank shells, I should really say. Um, coming really near me now, but I don't think um, on purpose. I, I try and snipe this plane, but then I realise I'm not going to get him, so don't do that. I'm trying to get to the corner of this warehouse where I just fire. And one of the main things I love about this tank, well... It looks like a tank which a little kid would design. Like one of those things. Because it's like turrets off to the right. I make a really big bold move. Don't really see where that guy just shot me from. But I bounce all of them. And I spotted him just above there. Take a shot. Boom. Target destroyed. Um, artillery fire comes in so I sit next to the wall. Well, it does, but we should be safe because the um, yeah, we should be safe. I've got seven kills now with one death, and at the top of my team, uh, I'm just holding A right now while Artie's just pummeling in. Uh, but yeah, this is just some nice gameplay. Um, my next video is probably going to be Halifax and then maybe another B29 which basically won us the war um, and I'll be progressing towards the Lancaster after that thought I saw the guy but no uh, I'm thinking oh let's see if we can get to 10 kills here because this is a really good game uh, put, press up to another oil tanker which someone could just uh, shoot at that it explodes and then kills me which is surprising why they didn't just trying a couple wonder shots Lit, dodge around by a centimeter thought it came behind me but no I look right now and we're getting nearer their spawn maybe maybe not just near but I look over and I see two kids uh, I need to check where they are there's one there's two fire once hits the wood which would have unfortunately got me the kill they hit also the wood so that's good I thought that was a guy but actually it was just a dead person see look the dead tank um, M2A4 starts rolling up so I do I kind of use him as a bit of a meat shield uh, see explosions coming left that must be one of the tanks rolled up M13 needs, uh, M2A4 needs help uh, unfortunately it died it's an M13 around this corner so I roll out there's the guy just aim for his upper plate boom get all three crew members <laughs> that was a dead tank which I was shooting at earlier 
think that's the guy when actually it's our team just shooting at the wall. Try and get a nice angle on this wall now, but I'm really exposed. So I move up into cover. Um, also, if you like tank gameplay, please like feel free to like give it a like and subscribe. That's lots of lag. This is lag which I was talking about. But yeah, I still get the kill on him, which is good. Um, but yeah, I've got... I'm quite good at tanks from Germany, and I've got 3.7s on America. I've got, I think it's an M10, I think I have. Something like that. Uh, but yeah, the game's almost ended. And this is one of my big mistakes. I roll up a bit too far. I see another guy waste one of my rounds. And M13 gets me. That's seven kills in one tank. That was some great gate um, plays by me. But yeah, see you in the next one.